Hey, Terry, first question for Calvin. What's up, Calvin? Mr. Happy Dude. What's going on with <laughs> What's you? What's up? How are you? I'm doing well. Hey, man, um, last year, no one know you. Now a lot of defense is trying to take you away from the offense. What are they doing, but yet you still get open? What are they doing different than they did beginning of the year? And how are you trying to, you know, try to stop that? Um, well, sometimes they'll either, you know, rotate a safety over or play some type of some type of zone. But um, really, I don't be I'm, I'm not too worried about that because I always know on the other side is I know they can't continue to do that because I know that I got Todd on the other side, Todd, Javon. And then behind me, I got Jeremy Tate, Kai. Cook. So, like, I'm not really – I don't really get too worried about um, the defense, what, what they're doing or trying to take away because I know it's going to eventually come to a point where they're not going to be able to do that because our, our, our other guys are just as capable. So, they're going to have to um, give the respect to, to everybody on the field. Evan? Coming into this. Calvin, do the slow starts, what are the slow starts saying about you guys? Why, why do you think that's been such a big problem? And also, you caught the thing when you touched down just like you did against UCF. How weird was that for you, kind of like with some day job, I guess? Um, some of the slow starts, I, I would say there is always, a, um, we're a, a, we're an inch away here or an inch away there in, in, in all perspectives. You know, uh, we'll be either an inch away from a pick, an inch away from a catch. That would have been a touchdown, you know. And, it, and sometimes we'll have um, penalties that, 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 that hurt our momentum in, in the drive we're on. So um, it's just – and we do have a young team. So, I mean, with a young team, you're going to have some, some mistakes like that. But – we really can't. We really can't make no excuses, and 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 honestly, it's it's about time we you know put that past us and we go ahead and put together a complete game. But um, and and uh, next for the next question, when you said uh, about the catch, um, that was a it was a great catch. I was really more impressed with on that drive. Um, Taj had a nice back shoulder. That was a great catch. Then Javon had a high ball. That was a great catch. And then Fox over the middle. Uh, Cameron Wilson over the middle. Um, that was the, that was probably the biggest play of the game in my opinion because you know Fox is kind of like a person like me. Um, he started, he came here as a defensive end, and then they moved him to, they moved him to tight end, and so it was just a he him having to learn the position, how to run routes, focusing on on his hands and catching, and so that was really the one of the most the biggest and one of the most special moments to see him make a big play like that. Devin. Calvin, what's good, man? What's up? How are you? All right, my question for you is I want to know about this celebration, man. When you, Taj, or any of you guys, y'all y'all score a touchdown, there's a, like a little, like a little power. What, explain it to me, man. Where'd, you, where'd it come so, from? <laughs> so whoever scores, that means they got the juice. So you can, you, 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 hold, your cup, you, hold, you hold your cup out and somebody got to pour you up. And, and once you score, you, you get to drink the juice. So it's always... Uh, a race to who gonna get poured up and get the juice. <laughs> Jacob. Hey, Calvin. Uh, this is once again another one point win. How does it feel to have the game that you had and still be on the right side of the scoreboard? Uh, it, it feels great because um, obviously, you know, stats never really matter, but you know, they feel better when it comes with a win, you know, so um, it's really, it's really, um, honestly, just a blessing. That's all I can say. It's, it's a, we had a great game, great, great game plan and execution in, in the second half. So I, I really don't try to pay too much attention about the stats, and I just go out there and play. But um, like, but, but like you said, everything is better with the win. And so, um, like you said, it's another one point win. We're trying to, like I said, get away from that and just come out and play a complete game because. We know once we play a complete game that, you know, the, the scoreboard will, will tell it. And so we just got to really just get back to the – just get back to square – get back to, to the basics and just continue to execute and lock in on, on the details even more. Thank you. Do two more for Calvin, starting with Terry. Hey, Kevin, uh, walk us through that 65-yard touchdown. And the second part of the question is, how did, how did heck Brady overthrow you, man? <laughs> uh, with the 65 yard touchdown, um, we had a play where we moved me to the slot and I was isolated with the safety. And um, 
the rest is history. It was one on one, no safety. Well, he was the safety, so there wasn't there ain't too much to say about that one. <laughs> but um, Brady overthrew me. Yeah, um, Brady was putting in some real, real work in the offseason, like working on on his body trans transformation, and um, so his arm is a little it's much stronger than what what it is, but. Really, um, it's gonna those those are gonna come. We're gonna we're gonna hit hit those, and uh, it's it's like like I said, some some of it is I I probably need to drive a little more, and um, you know, stay stay more on, on the line so he can he can lead me. But um, really, it, it is nothing to that. It's just uh, I'm a miss throw. <laughs> Devin, all right, Calvin, you taught Anthony uh for fourth, your fourth consecutive 100-yard receiving game. I know you say you don't really pay attention to numbers, but as a Memphian, as a native Memphian, to toss someone like Ant, what does that mean to you uh, kind of going forward? It's really crazy because, um, shoot, like like you said, he's a hometown kid. I'm, I'm a hometown kid. And so uh, it's really – that's all I can say is crazy because I remember coming to the um, spring game the year before I had Kane. And I, I was watching him. I was like, yeah, this dude, he the best receiver in the nation. I already, just from watching him, just, you could just tell it was something different. And so it's crazy to think that, like, I was once going to the games as a fan, just watching and stuff. And now, like, I'm out there doing that same thing. And really, I don't, it's, it's really overwhelming. And it's just, it's just crazy. And it's a blessing. I just got to thank God, honestly. Thank you, Calvin. Thank y'all.